Now at 6.30, two firefighters hurt this morning during an explosion while battling this fire in Anaheim. And good Sunday evening, everyone. I'm Chris Holmstrom. And I'm Leslie Muddy. And well, that massive explosion happened as a suspected illegal butane marijuana lab. A suspect was also injured in that blast. The building, it's located in an industrial park on Knowwood Circle. That's just off the 5 freeway. CBS 2's Lori Perez is there live with the very latest. Lori. And investigators say this was a very, very dangerous situation that had the potential to cause even more damage and more injuries than it did. Right away, I want to show you the damage left behind by this powerful explosion. You can see the massive holes blown into the building. You can see the continuing uh, response. They are trying to make sure that any hot spots are watered down here. Now, through those gaping holes, we can see the blackened, burned out insides after a ferocious fire here just before 1130. This morning. <laughs> oh. That was just one explosion. That's when Anaheim Fire responded here to North Knollwood Circle and say they found the one story commercial building fully engulfed. The thick black smoke could be seen for miles. Anaheim police say they've determined it was a honey oil extraction lab, which is illegal and extremely risky. Honey oil, also known as hash oil, is taken from marijuana. During the attack on the flames, witnesses say there were several big explosions. And investigators tell us during the initial approach to the fire, two firefighters were hurt. One suffered burns to his face. The other was blown back by an explosion and hurt his back. Both were taken to local hospitals, are expected to be okay. Also, police say a man working in the lab was severely injured. He was transported as well. Investigators say these kinds of illegal butane marijuana labs put those working at them, first responders, and neighbors or neighboring businesses at extreme risk. So the process that they do to extract the oil from the marijuana is they use butane, which is highly flammable and highly explosive. So it's a very, very dangerous uh, procedure. We've had the last one in Anaheim was a couple years ago, uh, but we have had them inside people's uh, garages at residential areas. There was one in an apartment complex that had it exploded. It could have taken out an entire apartment complex. They're very extremely dangerous. Now, police have detained another man who they say was here and associated with the lab. They say he was not hurt. Now, Pena says the nature of the fire and what was burning means there is still some danger here, which is why you see this continuing response. They will be here. They're expected to be here throughout the night to make sure that no hot spots reignite any problems. In Anaheim, I'm Lori Perez. Back to you.